the comparison inside the Joker role, right? Because you've you have experience of seeing one of these people kind of really dive in. There's yeah. these rumors and reports of how the way that he kind of prepped for it, and then there's these rumors and reports of how both the other guys. Right. What do you think it is about this role? And if you can speak about some of kind of what you saw in Jared Leto's experience, I think what it is about the role is the pressure to really transform. I think perhaps um, I don't know. I mean, look, not that I know anything about what what they're doing with this. Uh, with this new incarnation, but it seems like there's a little more kind of humanity in Joaquin's uh, development of that character, yeah. you know, certainly than what we saw in like the first squad. Um, so man, I mean, look, yeah, I mean, Jared was doing some some crazy stuff. I mean, I, I never met him out of character. Oh, what, he was always in character. Yeah, was he really and sending condoms to people and stuff? He, is that true? Oh, he, yeah, he was doing all sorts of crazy <laughs> shit. That's nothing, dude. No, the really, con- sending condoms. I know that doesn't even like. What was the craziest thing he did then? Well, he would just like he got very like generous with the gifts that like he would kind of that would hand generous. On. And it started out with like some stuff that he sent Margot while we were in uh, pre-production. We would do like in rehearsal kind of stuff, and this like bag. What he sent like there was like a. a uh, uh, she got like a snake in a box. A live snake? Uh, yeah, I can't remember if the snake came first or uh, there was a there was a also rat. a rat, uh. and the rat stuck around. The rat was the rat was like a little mascot there for a while. <laughs> got passed around a few households. Uh, Did she freak out or she was cool with it? No, she was cool. I think the snake was like pretty gnarly. It was yeah. this tiny little snake. I don't know what the fate of the snake kind of became. Um, but yeah, there was a few things, and like he was doing, and it was like it was good because it was a way of kind of bringing himself into that space when he wasn't, you know, for whatever, that's his process. And, right. you know, actors, You guys got it. You understood. You, you, yeah. you have to. It's yeah. kind of one of the fundamentals of, like, our craft is you don't... I mean, even if you want to bitch about it in the corner, you kind of respect how someone needs to get through their day. And so it's not for us to decide whether that's helpful to or not. And I've seen, you know, I've seen... You know, uh, colleagues of mine do it in instances where I'm like, I totally understand why you feel you need to. And I've seen it happen where you think it's just a waste of energy and it's not bringing out anything else in their performance. But it doesn't matter. It's not, you know, it's like, do your thing. Right. So were people bitching about it in the corner? No, but it was early on. We were kind of like, well, what's up? Like, where's Jared, man? Like, we're all in here. Like, And we were breaking down the script every day. And, like, we built this amazing camaraderie right. between each other, which still is there. Uh, and uh, so there was like a bit of like confusion around like, oh, what's the deal here? Like, you know, is someone's time more important than ours? And it wasn't about that. And I think him, he involved himself in that by kind of reaching out and he would send kind of, he would send videos and there'd be sort of, this sort of stuff. So there was communication. And I think once we got over our own bullshit yeah. and just kind of understood that actually it wasn't about ego, it was just about trying to preserve the space because his character doesn't really interact with anyone you know, in that sense, anyway, uh, I totally understood it. I think everyone else did too. And and honestly, I applauded it because I can't imagine how exhausting it must have been for him to try and maintain that every day. I'm sure he gave the producers hell trying to, like, wrangle that because they really, like, everyone helped preserve that. Yeah. And it was just an understanding.